pre warm up thing, whatever. But right. however you want to get comfortable. Um, you want to sit, you want to stand, whatever. Okay. But we just gonna sit over there and act like we want to judge it all. But, um, <laughs> okay, hello I mean, YouTube. So basically, so my uncle is about to sit for a talent show. So essentially, what and we're looking for is I'm going to have you heard of the Cross Cultures Festival? With two Let phones. My uncle. Your first time ever hearing about it. Yeah. Do you hear <coughs> Justin? Yeah, but I don't go around. My phone. Gotcha. So, okay. So it's been going on for what? Years did you say? Yeah. Like I'm trying to record a book. What the heck did you go to Chester High? Yeah. Yeah, did they it's
festival, right? So because we're black doesn't mean the choice of the sing R and B and rap. You know what I mean? We went to Strand Haven. We went to Strand Haven. Yeah, we 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 so our listen, listen, you came in here with rock. We didn't like, oh, we back. Okay. You know, yeah. it, it doesn't. So okay, if that wouldn't phase us, because it's all about culture. Right, and if that's what we're trying to promote, I mean, like you could have got up here and sang in your shit, you're fooling. You know, like, it wouldn't have mattered because it's culture. Yeah, culture comes in all different shades, yeah. all different shapes, all different sizes, all different ages. So <coughs> don't be afraid to be who you are mm -hmm. just because you think it's the black thing. No, mm -hmm. like we're we're all for different culture, and yeah. I mean, if heavy rock is your thing. Then yeah. you and all your friends who do heavy rock, you bring them to this festival because that's what this is about. Do Change you have it. any music on your phone? Like something that you can... That is low. Yeah. yeah. Where you can play a song and, and, and... I know metal is not the best to do acapella. Yeah. I bet yeah. I yeah. know. But actually, yeah, I've done it though. Um, I did, did it before. Now, now do you play an <laughs> instrument as well or you just you do the pre-recording? Unfortunately, I do not play instruments yet. He plays flute. I'm not playing the flute. Yes, you are. <laughs> you were doing it when we were waiting. You <laughs> play the flute? Yeah, I was practicing for. You have the flute in your bag? Yeah. Pull the flute out! Get <laughs> control. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> You're welcome. I just helped you. Well, <laughs> another flute support. Oh, recorder. Okay. All right. But listen, we had someone who was with a kazoo. And yeah, somebody who tried out with a kazoo. All right. So don't you feel. Kazoo kid. So what do you do with the recorder? The recorder, I kind of play either native songs or anything that's like sax beautiful. But unfortunately, I can't play a really native song. But one of them I have learned what's called a Lugia song. Have you ever heard of Pokemon? Pokemon? Pokemon. Oh, yeah. Um, it, was, it was made in the 2000 movie, the second movie they made, and it was for a mythical beast known as Lugia. That okay. was the song they did play for it. Okay. So that's right,
I'm learning like you did. That's good. That's good. That's good. I, I think, and this is just personally for me speaking, I, I believe that you have talent. Hee hee. I, I think that you, and based off of what my vision is, I don't care what everybody else's <laughs> vision is. I'm only looking at mine because I'm the only one that's here besides her. So I'm, I'm letting you know. That based off of what it is that we're trying to accomplish and to make this more of a community-minded thing, um, I say I'm going to go for it. I, I think that you you bring a sense of dedication <coughs> and determination. And there's a difference between somebody who does it because they're dedicated and they want to learn and they want to get better at it than as opposed to somebody who knows that they got it and it's just supposed to be handed to them. Them the kind of people that I'm like, hey, man, all right, but people like you, you are the ones that, to me, y'all pull at my heartstrings because I understand, I see the hard work and dedication just based off of when you were singing anything and even playing that. I can see that you put time into it and that you practice and that you know at some point you weren't where other people were, but you're trying to get there and you're working for that. And so for that, that's what moves me and that's what I appreciate the most. So I have your number. I don't know, Shane, if you want to say anything. To kind of feel I want to hear the, the, the rock. I know, I, I really do too. Or if we, but what time is it? Because I got to take this up to the phone. Right, and I got a I gotta bouncy, baby, bouncy. You okay, so, so maybe can, we can set up another date. Yeah. Set up another date. Okay. All right, and then, because we really want to hear that, because yes. that's where you're at. And like I said, I hear the passion behind what you sung, and I mean, you did an awesome job, but I can tell that there is something inside of you when it comes to what you're really passionate about, and that's what we want to see, because I really feel like that's where you're going to really truly shine, and you're going to have your whole movement, and you know what I mean? You're going to really sell the crowd, and that's what, you know what I mean? You want to be able to do that. I mean, you know, the older people, they probably be like, what is that noise? But I'm going to be like, yeah, I know I'm going to be a friend. And then it's encouraging for other people, because I'm like, us, you know, being black people, we kind of get put in the box of, like I said, it has to be rap or it has to be R&B. I love rock. I love alternative rock. Like I said, we both went to Strathaven, which at this time, it was like a handful of us there. And I didn't have the best experience there, but what it did was it opened my eyes to different genres of music. Mm -hmm. And um, it's encouraging. If you get on stage and you know you do your, your metal thing, your rock thing, then that little girl, that little boy that maybe struggle with that sees that it's okay. Mm -hmm. Like, I can be brown, and I can still like this music. You see what I'm saying? So it's encouraging. Always be true to yourself. Don't ever think because I'm black, I gotta know. Do what you do, okay? And don't let anybody start, you know, stray away from that. Mm -hmm. So, I wanna hear that. Yeah. So let's, um, so on Monday, I'm going to give you a call, and then maybe we can, once we kind of get our schedules together, because I know we have a, um, I have a, a model search uh, next week, and I know it's a, quite a few people that signed up for that. Um, so let me check my calendar, and then, because I want to give you like, you know, a week or two to kind of, you know, get yourself together, kind of figure out what you want to do, um, and then we'll, we'll set that time up, and we'll definitely meet, so you can just like wow us, because I know that's what you're going to do. Right, so, but thank you for coming. Thank you, thank you for waiting for me. Yo. Sorry for my CP time. I appreciate it. Michael Bennett. Michael Bennett? Okay. It was right, nice Michael, Michael, it was nice meeting you. Thank you. It was nice to meet you too, sweetheart. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> you're very welcome, sweetheart. Keep it up. Right, Keep it up. Next time we want to see you do something. <laughs> you can probably sing too, can't you? She sings. He don't hear me. I sing a wall. Sing, sing, sing around me. I know, I sing alone. You. I'm scared. I was scared I sing around you. <laughs> sing Mary Had a Little Lane. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just Mary Had a Little Lane. That's it. Oh, Mary Had a Little Lane. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Right. Here, I start everything. You, you sing gospel music? No. Me? No. Yeah. No. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. I like singing. I like singing night chords. Nightcore. Night chorus. What's that? It's, it's they take regular songs but make the voice a little different. It's almost like it's like a uh, weird meme thing. But but it's it's almost like meme, but it's actually like it has a big following when it comes to actually making different music sounds different. Yeah, something like that. Like but yeah. in a different player. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Alright. <laughs> yes. The best way to look it up the best way thing to do is probably look it up. <laughs> <laughs>
Because that's the only no, way you can find it. She's just singing for me right here. I mean, I mean no, because what they do is they actually change the voice pitch. So like a voice like a. It's almost like <laughs> you, you heighten, when it comes to uh, night. I know with night chord, they heighten their voice up, and they also have white chord, which is they, they deepen it. Is it like um, so? Like what T Pain can yeah. do with his voice? Yeah, something like that, but not to the extreme. Yeah. Night not to the extreme. Yeah, but it's like that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I'm just saying. <laughs> hey. We're looking for different talents. So <laughs> and if you have friends, that's yeah. Different. Like, we'll have enough, believe me, enough gospel, enough R&B, enough rap, okay? We want that generation is what we're looking for. Yeah. Right. Okay, Thank we you. need, the, this is the generation that we need. <laughs> yeah. So y'all, from your age all the way down to babies, we're looking for this. We're looking for our generation to just really come to this festival. All right. Okay. Alright. Okay, you saying okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, please. I'm going to call you Monday. I will. All right, honey. Thank you. Bye. See ya. Well, that was my uncle singing. Say hi to him. Hello. Okay, so oh, I'll get. This horrible. So I'll oh, will record when I get when we get home. So see you later. <laughs>